Wired Hair Fox Terrier is like a typical terrier. They're considered feisty, mischievous, and full of energy. What that really means is that when the doorbell rings or they hear a sound outside, they're bouncing off you, the furniture, and the walls like a Super Bowl on caffeine. They've got a lot of spunk to them. Some people think of it as aggression, but it's just what they were bred to do. They're just doing their job. Like other terriers, these dogs have a long list of ancestors. From the now extinct black and tan terrier, to the dachshund, the English hound, beagle, and foxhound. But it was a famous dog actor named Asta who was responsible for America falling in love with the wire fox terrier in the 40s and 50s. Asta appeared in The Thin Man, The Awful Truth, and Bringing Up Baby. This breed has a medium length coat that has a dense wiry texture. It features a long rectangular muzzle ending in a wiry beard. They have an athletic body and muscular legs that give them their speed and incredible reflexes. And they have a special tail, one that quivers, not wags. It points straight up and is strong enough to help pull them out of trouble. It's a happy, buoyant, feisty breed whose nose leads it from one misdemeanor to another. The average pet owner couldn't handle a dog that had the same intensity of a dog that was really used to hunt. Most breeders now are breeding for dogs with a little bit softer character. Need some help? Wire Fox Terriers also demonstrate spunk in the show ring, as they have 13 best of show wins, more than any other breed. The Wire Fox Terrier is a high energy dog, so it'll need room to move, but it's a small dog and can live in smaller spaces, like apartments. You need to make sure that you're extra diligent about socializing this dog with other puppies at a very, very young age. Regular brushing is required. But if your dog is to show, plucking the coat is required. You hand strip them. These coats were made to be pulled out because it keeps the skin in tip-top condition. Not the easiest dog to train, this independent terrier will test you. One thing that makes them difficult to train is that they're independent. Because they're not as focused on you, you have to train them to be focused on you. All in all, wire fox terriers are a healthy breed. Some of them are prone to cataracts, a few have shoulder and hip problems, and some skin disorders can develop if you don't keep them hand stripped and groomed properly. Like a lot of the smaller dogs, they don't do well with children. It is a terrier, they're intense. Generally speaking, this would be a dog that probably doesn't have as high a tolerance level for children. Although the wire fox terrier may not be a good fit for everyone, they'll go anywhere with you and keep vet bills low. Pluck the hair for show, be strict in training, and it's a good dog for a family that understands terriers. Good wave, America. Let's ride one last one, Adam.